Liden. In Chinese cooking techniques, there are various heating methods such as steam cooking, fire cooking, stone cooking, salt cooking, clay cooking, etc. Different heat transfer media procedure or different flavor characteristics. In this lesson, we will learn together to use salt as a heat transfer medium to make baked cod with tea salt. Let's see what wonderful effect happens when tea is added to salt as a heat transfer medium. Teaching Objective Master the procedure and cooking techniques of cod baked in tea salt. Teaching Difficulty How to determine if the fish is done? How to consider the temperature and time of baking? How to better let the tea flavor tea aroma release to the fish? Teaching Content Through the display of raw materials, explanation of cooking process, live demonstration and characteristics of the finished dish, the complete teaching process of tea salt baked cod is demonstrated. The tea we use in this dish today is Anxi Tai Guan Yin and silver cod as the main ingredients. Introduction of Raw Materials The strong fragrance of Tai Guan Yin has the characteristics of fragrant, strong, mellow, and sweet, with the bright color, golden soup, pure aroma, and heavy taste. Comparing to the clear aroma type, the strong aroma type Tai Guan Yin is warm in nature and has the effect of quenching thirst, increasing body fluid, and warming the spleen and stomach. Silver cod, scientifically known as bear cover, grows in the deep sea bottom at 700 to 1,000 meters. Its flesh is rich in high-quality protein, tasting amino acids, and saturated fatty acids, minerals, vitamins, and delicious taste, with high nutritional value and health effects. Raw materials Main ingredients 250 grams silver cod 30 grams aromatic ANSI Taiwan Yen Supplementary ingredients 500 grams of fine salt 50 grams of egg white 1 western lemon 30 grams of onion 30 grams of celery 30 grams of carrot 10 grams of garlic cloves Seasoning 3 grams salt 2 grams white pepper 20 milliliters white wine 50 milliliters olive oil Process and Procedures Step 1 Clean and dry the cod Onion Celery carrot, and lemon and set aside. Step 2. Shred the onion, celery, and carrot. Slice the zesty lemon. Cut the snowfish into pieces and set aside. Step 3. Drain the silver cod with kitchen paper. Step 4. 
Add shredded onion, shredded carrot, lemon slices, garlic cloves, salt, pepper, white wine, olive oil, and shredded celery. Refrigerate for half an hour and set aside. Step 4. Mash ANSI Taiwan Yin with cooking machine. Whip the egg white to turn it into white. The crushed tea leaves with fine salt. Then add the whipped egg white and mix well to become the tea salt for salt baking and set aside. Step 5. Take the cut out of the marinade and remove the marinade ingredients from the surface. Drain the surface again with kitchen paper. Smear it evenly with olive oil. Cover the baking tray with tin foil. Spread a layer of tea salt on the tin foil. Place the cod on the tea salt. and wrap the cod completely with the prepared tea salt. Step 6. Place the salt sealed cod in the preheated oven. Set the oven to 180 degrees Celsius and bake for 25 minutes. Adjust the baking time according to the size of the fish. Step 7. Take out the baked and cooked cod. Remove the tea salt from the surface and serve. Characteristics of the finished dish The cod is white, tender, and juicy. The tea aroma of the Taiwan Yin is pungent, salty, and tender. The aroma of the tea salt completely penetrates on every muscle fiber on the cod through heat. 
it neutralizes an excessively fishy taste of the fish, making it rare and a delicious dish. Through this lesson, we have mastered the preparation of white tea dumplings. But we should pay attention to the following points. The tea leaves need to be completely mashed to better release the tea flavor of the tea aroma. The marinade with the lemon can better remove the fishy smell. To determine the doneness of the fish, it can refer to the dryness, wetness, and hardness of the wrapped tea salt. Hitting the tea salt with a spoon to make a crisp sound so that the heat penetrates completely inside. The baking time of the fish can be determined by the size of the baked fish and the temperature of baking. After baking to be done, remove and let it rest for 3 to 5 minutes to allow the cod to cool down slowly and contract back to absorb the juices. That's all for this lesson. Thanks!